of the cool things about the iPhone 4 is that the camera is flush to the case. So you can hold up uh, a lot of different lenses to the camera lens that's built in and get a bunch of different effects. Uh, I've seen a lot of hacks that use things like uh, CD or DVD player lens and I tried that recently. Um, but I was at a thrift shop the other day and I saw a bunch of old 35 millimeter cameras um, they're selling for between one and three dollars. So I picked one up with the zoom and I tore it apart. And this is what I found. It was definitely a very labor intensive process. Um, there's a lot of screws and a lot of different parts in this camera. Um, just a really cheap 35 millimeter camera. Uh, I pulled out this face plate up here and used it as a mount for the lenses that I found inside of the camera. So I took all of the lenses out of the camera and super glue them onto this strip that I can hold up to the cell phone camera and get a bunch of different effects. So I'm going to show you a couple of them. This one's pretty cool, it's a basic fish eye. The second one is just magnification. Third one's just a little bit of magnification. Fourth one is even more magnification. And the last one is the uh, DVD CD lens that I showed in another video. That's the tiny one here. The uh, best find though is the lens from the front of the camera, which is very easy to hold up to the cell phone camera and gives you a pretty reasonable amount of uh, zoom. I like this a lot better than a lot of the other lenses that I've tried because you don't have to get so close that you have a problem with lighting. So if you have an hour to spare and very small screwdriver, I would definitely give this a shot.